two, three, dub. What are you going to do to be proactive when you leave here? I'm going to listen to others more. Okay. Uh, one of the things I'm actually going to do is share the information or what I felt was most valuable here with my team so that as I'm growing, um, they can also grow and understand where I'm coming from. Okay. Motivate my team and just concentrate on the circle of influence. Because okay. I can concentrate on the circle of concern too much. I'm going to work on my own personal weather because I think that's important into how I re react to other people and how other people react to me. Same here as, as far as how I respond to others rather than... Uh, if something negative is coming my way, rather than just popping off at the mouth right away, just actually step, like the step, step back and think about it and then come back with a more correct response. I'm going to go into this being a little more positive with my team, have more confidence in what I'm doing, give them more confidence. Okay. What are you going to do back when you get back to your dealership or to your life? Like create, create more of a, a plan and a, and, a, and a method for work days and work weeks and so we go into each day with a plan. Uh, work on myself first so that I can influence others. Uh, be proactive instead of reactive. And How? Instill that. Um, you know, watching key phrases and working on myself and, and eventually trying to influence my team. Um, I definitely want to share some of these activities with our team. Um, that way we can all work on changing things together. Uh, not letting negative people who are negative influence me. I want to take a lot of the information that I learned back to my dealership. Um, like as far as the video with the trees, I feel like the roots are the dealership and that everybody can grow out of that. So I want everybody to grow, not just my department. I'm going to try to start being more assertive and expressing my opinion instead of sitting back and being shy. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go back and try to do a, a strategic planning session about a lot of things we talked about with our department heads and uh, try to implement a plan for next year. Okay. I'm going to go back and communicate with my staff, um, kind of going over the seven uh, habits of effective people and start with them. each day go with each one of the, the steps with them and have them go through the process with me. Uh, I just want to lead by example. I'm a new manager, so I got a lot of respect to gain from our senior salespeople and, uh, and other staff. We're kind of relaunching the site. It's kind of not been working. Uh, well, the department's not been working the way it's been wanting to be worked. So I want to show everybody that I can make this happen for them and make everybody a lot of money in the dealership, not just me. Okay, good. Andre, what are you going to do when you get out of here to be proactive? Get my girlfriend to take this course because she needs it. <laughs> <laughs> No, nah, but seriously though, I'm uh, not just my attitude at work, man. That's my main thing. I'm gonna go uh, start with that tomorrow. It's a lot of negative things going on at work right now, but I'm seeing that I can change me right. as far as how I react to it, and therefore my job will probably be better and more comfortable for myself. No, and for the record, Kathy does damn sure need to take this class too. Yeah, there's no doubt. Put that right. on tape. It's on tape. <laughs> and what about you, sir? Quick complaints. So much. Okay.